So you see how this is where I'm recovering? See the recovery work we're doing here? A blessing of the garden ceremony was held in October 2007 at La Florian, the Northern Michigan University Lutheran Campus Ministry House near Lake Superior in Marquette, Michigan. Performing the ceremony was Reverend John Magnuson, Director of Lutheran Campus Ministry, and Reverend Teshin Paul Lemberg, Head Priest of Lake Superior Zendo, a Marquette Zen Buddhist temple. So let us pray. The La Florian lawn has been turned into a native plants garden that includes rocks from three of the Great Lakes. O oh, you who have created the heavens and the earth, who makes the sun to rise, and has flung the moon into the far skies, who breathes life into animals and people and plants, a bless this garden today and these prayers and these people from different walks of life who have come together to claim this as holy ground, that it may be a sign of hope and redemption for all things. Amen. And let the people say Amen. Amen. We're going to light a stick of incense, uh, which we do in our tradition. Uh, the incense is a thank you offering. Prayers, incense, bells, and chants were part of the ceremony that included a tour of the garden by Northern Michigan University student Michael Joko Rotter, who is a member of the Lake Superior Zendo. Shikura, Shikura, Hara, Shikura, Hara, Shikura, Chisuka, Chisuka, Chisuri, Chikuri, Sohaja, Sohaja, Senshi, Gya, Shiri, Somoto, Samo, Samanda, Motona, No Hara, Chikokosha, Sononan, Toji, Toen, Gya, 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 Ki, Gya, Ki, Onnon, Shikura, Shikura, Hara, Shikura, Hara, Shikura, Chisusa, Chisusa, Chikushi, Chisuri, Sohaja, Sohaja, Senshi, Gya, Shiri, E, Somoko, No, No, Samanda, Motonan, No, Hara, Chi, Kotosha, Sononan, Koji, Toen, Gya, 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 Ki, Gya, Ki, Onnon, Shikura, Shikura, Hara Shikura, Hara Shikura, Chisuka, Chisura, Chisuri, Chisuri, So, So, Haja, So, Hasa, Sen, Shiga, Shiri, So, No, So, So. Now we have offered incense and chanted the Sho, Si, Myo, Kichi, Cho, Charani. All Buddhas throughout space and time, all honored ones, bodhisattvas, mahasattvas, wisdom beyond wisdom. I can't talk. Praise God. from this garden today with peace.
Now we have a little liturgical action called the passing of peace, which is a, a handshake or a hug. And I'm going to begin with Sue. So feel free to peace the Lord be with you. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh, thank you. A heavy rain poured the entire day, almost causing the ceremony to be moved inside. But the sun came out for 20 minutes, and the rain resumed just as the blessing and tour were completed. The Lutheran Campus Ministry house name, Lothlorien, comes from the Lord of the Rings trilogy by J.R.R. Tolkien. The garden includes numerous different plants from Michigan and others from the Boreal border regions of the northern United States, including Black Eye Susan, Aster, Dogbane, Blue Stem, and Sensitive Fern. Um, columbine is wonderful, Wild Columbine, uh, Coryopsis, Black Eyed Susan, Bee Balm are also Wild Bergamot. NMU student Michael Rotter, who manages the garden, said the students hope neighbors will enjoy the beauty of the native plants and use it as an example for their lawns. The first section, um, we wanted to make it so it was sort of like a more traditional garden, um, but obviously we'd be using native plants and whatnot in this area. But a lot of these plants are really small right now because you know, they're plugs, uh, which are just the seedlings. But in a year or two, um, they should be get established and get growing pretty big. The um, thing about natives is they take a little bit longer to start than a lot of horticultural plants mainly because we have to grow them and they're not as widely available right now commercially. So a lot of these you probably can't see in here, um, but some of the major uh, plants we put in here is along the walkways and on the edges we have a grass called um, Big Blue Stem, which is a really beautiful plant and will get about as tall as me and um, eventually once it gets later in the year around now, the will see out in the wild. They'll have beautiful seed heads on them. Rotter is also a member of the NMU Earthkeeper student team and led the fight to save a native plant project at the university. Reverend John Magnuson, a Lutheran pastor who dreamed of the Earthkeeper initiative in northern Michigan a decade ago, said, quote, Lothlorien is a magical kingdom, part of what Tolkien called Middle Earth where time passes differently. Magnuson said one of the first images of the Old Testament around the beauty of God's creation is a garden. Reverend Magnuson said our natural native plants landscaping, our Lothlorien garden, is a sign of a new way of living with the world. It honors the indigenous and native plants of our region. He said the garden and the name of the Lutheran Campus Ministry House reflect the way the students feel about nature. Reverend Magnuson said Lothlorien came into being first as a song. He said the garden will need little, if no, artificial watering, no fertilizers, and will be a haven for birds and other small creatures. Reverend Magnuson said the fountain flows with the water of Lake Superior and represents the waters of our baptism. The fountain in the garden is going to be converted to solar power in the spring of 2008, and the sun will charge a battery allowing the water to flow in cloudy weather. Reverend Magnuson said in back of the house there are rocks from the Lake Superior watershed. Quote, the pebbles represent the different worlds of the individuals who make up the region and the people in the Great Lakes Basin. The Central Upper Peninsula chapter of Thriving Financial for Lutherans donated $1,600 to the Lutheran Campus Ministry Native Plants Project. Judy Quirk, president of the Thrivent Central UP chapter said it's breaking new ground. Quote, students are involved and we like to support things that young people are going to be enthusiastically involved in like this native plants garden. Quirk said turning the Lutheran campus ministry lawn into an eco-friendly garden was a project worth doing. Quote, they had the students do it and there was the enthusiasm. Rotter, a Zen Buddhist member of the NMU Earthkeeper student team, said, quote, we hope this will allow people to learn about the amazing diversity of our native plant communities. Rotter said, quote, the Zen garden represents our interconnected lives in nature. The stones from each of the Great Lake watersheds represent the flow of water, the substance that gives us life. Rotter said, quote, the garden represents the hope of the future. I'm Greg Peterson, and you're watching Earthkeeper TV.